Takus will one day rule the world. Kawaii Rice. I'll show you in a minute. But first, introductions. Jamie. Zach. We are with uh, Kozaku no Takus and we have Anime Crate. Woo! We have been waiting all day to open this fucker. Here's the tape, by the way, Zach. There. Other side. Yeah. Shut up. <laughs> so, as you can see, seal's not broken. I'm going to kind of take point in this video. I think this is Zach's first unboxing, so. Yeah, Keep first seeing. unboxing, first channel. But it's going to be fun. Let's see what we got. I think next time we should have a more awesome knife. Not more of a, hey, let's just stab somebody kind of knife that... Kitchenware. I'm saving it for the end of the video when we really get them with the finale when I stab you in the fucking throat and listen to your blood gurgle out of the hole. We're not going to have a big channel for long, are we? <laughs> it's okay. We're already rated in for mature. So it's all good. I'm waiting on you. It's already open. You ready? All right. One, two, three. I already opened it. Oh. All right. Where to start? I know where you're wanting to start. Shirt, right? Nope. Uh, from everything I've watched unboxing wise, I'm perfectly okay with our channel doing the same thing. Shirt last, even though I kind of see the top of it, which still is fantastic. You pick the mug. Of course. <laughs> we have a Loot Crate exclusive Attack on Titan mug, because I don't have enough of those fuckers already. Try not to look at the bottom, because I've seen the picture of a manga, I think. You did. Uh, I really hope I didn't just spoil that for the viewers. <laughs> uh, surprise. Actually, I think maybe I did. By confirming it. Pretty nice. Good quality. I'm an Attack on Titan fan. Looks like uh, yours is a little uh, dirty. I'd maybe wash it before you use it. Oh, it's styrofoam. If anything, it's going to be used for a drink glass. Oh, yeah. No, that's the only purpose of it anymore. No, not just drink, drink. I'm talking drink. Yes, yeah, what I'm saying. That's, that's what I use my, my carnage mug. I can't take it to work, so that's what that's for. So You don't even open the box. Yeah, I keep all my mugs in my box. I'm going to say, for all you viewers, I'm new at all this collecting stuff in any kind of crate, but I use my items instead of collecting them. I'm like him. Of course, he has some pretty awesome stuff. As you can kind of see. <laughs> nope, a... most of it's cut out just the Konaki mask and the Destiny poster. I, I think you can see about, a little bit of the sword. Nope. Talking can't. about that. <laughs> talking about the... Oh, uh, my, my Breaking Bad apron? Yes. <laughs> That's what I was talking about. <laughs> yeah, that actually came in a crate. That's uh, what I'm saying. I was going to imply that you are a crate person. Oh, yeah. No, I've been a member for two years now. I'm going on going on two years total, but I've had to skip a few months. Uh, so for the last year, I've been getting stuff. What's next? Okay. We'll let you pick the next item. So we have some Attack on Titan bandages. Fucking glare. There we go. I don't normally do this. I'm not a slut, but today. I'm opening these. <laughs> you guys kind of wonder why we had such a kitchen knife. Just wait. <laughs> God damn it. Actually, yes. <laughs> I was going to say, it's, I wanted to test the band aid so when I cut myself after this is over. Uh, well, that should have got, got cut somehow at work. Having the sex with the bees and the eagles. Yes. They're actually some pretty good quality band-aids. They actually are. There's three designs. You got the, uh, I think that's the regular emblem. I'm trying to put whatever this is you over got the top of the manga so I can't see what it is. Attack on Titan. Because it looks like I some didn't really the manga strange already. quality. No, and I don't want you to because we're not there yet. And then you got the chibis. Because nothing says you're an otaku like if you cut yourself. Let's put an Attack on Titan bandage on. And no one says you're an emo otaku quite like cutting yourself to bandage it up with a Attack on Titan band-aid. Nothing says emo, emo at all about that because <laughs> they don't ever bandage anything up. They just oh, yeah. put long shirts on. We are going for this one next. Best oh, yes. of anime box. These come from a uh, Hot Topic and shit. I think they're like uh, eight bucks over there. We actually got them in our store. Do you really? How much? Uh huh. Uh, seven ninety nine a box. Yeah, I was gonna say I think they're about eight bucks. Oh yeah, I forgot we have a knife. 
Yeah, I was gonna say, just I don't want to damage the box too much. I know I'm gonna open it anyway, so this is fucking matter. Everybody that's gonna watch the channel, it's gonna be full of sarcasm. Ho ho ho! We're so funny. I swear to God, if I get happy, I'm gonna be so fucking heated. You know what's awesome though? Because oh, this dude. is a mini. <laughs> There's no possible way we can get the same thing. I know. <laughs> and then watch, we're gonna get the same exact fucking thing. I'm gonna tear it, but I'm not looking until until I open mine as well. Yours open. I'm trying to fill it and see what it is. Cheater. I don't know. I can't tell by the fill. He's got long hair. <laughs> Cheater. <laughs> I don't know. Hang on. Who can you? You can get uh, get Sebastian, CL, Natsu, Happy, Soul, Maka, Kirito. You can get a Heath Titan. Cliff. You can get a Titan. Awesome enough. Where the hell do you see Heath? Oh yeah, there you see. Yeah, you get Heath Cliff. That's the Pretty bottom left hand. You have a one in twelve chance of getting all of these. <laughs> all <laughs> the odds are so not in the favor. <laughs> Alright. Take yours out. Take yours out. Oh, no! <laughs> you got happy. What did you get? Asuna. Oh, you son of a bitch! <laughs> and I said if I got happy, I was going to be pissed, but actually he looks kind of cool. I hate you. I like him. I'll switch. No, fuck yeah, you. Yeah, I know how that works. <laughs> Fuck, she's going on the shelf right now. Uh -uh, this is my girl, dude. She's going to stand right here next to Captain Mel. That's okay. I guess uh, you know is out of the picture, then that's cool. Thanks. Well, no. No, no. Uh, awesome no, man, no, you no, know. no, no, I, no. I take them both. You got to have the crazy and you got to have the, like, yandere. All right. The yandere and the uh, sundere. Okay, so uh, I guess we should go shirt next, probably. Right? Shirt last. You're going to go with the poster that exposes everything instead. Fair enough. I'm new to this, so no. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go for. Should we go for the the? Go for the shirt. Well, see, the thing is, it's like okay, which okay. one do we like more? Hang on. Do we want to? Well, you've seen everything. Yeah. That's why I know what to do. Screw. Let's do the. Go. Go with the book. The book. The book. Go with weeaboo. the. Go with the comic. Even more for weeaboo. <laughs> Americanized weeaboo. No. Now hold on. That lady pissed me off too. Fuck her. <laughs> All she, right. Fucking stupid bitch. Who I'm does gonna, this? I'm just gonna flip it up. Because I'm pretty sure I know what the top is because I just read the back part of it. But. But it's a variant cover. So you can't get it anywhere else. That's actually kind of interesting. Yeah, it's a Loot Crate exclusive. You it's can go loot. to the store and buy a volume one of the same book we're holding. It's going to look completely different. different. It kind of actually makes me seem to want to actually get the series depending on how good it is. I already told you I'm getting it. It's very good. Seven Deadly Sins. Ooh. Volume one. Loot Crate anime exclusive. It's making the camera go crazy because of the colors. It's it can't amazing. handle the awesomeness. Look at that. And then we put the books down and the camera's fine. It literally, I think it was the colors. Huh, now it's not doing it. There's just an overload of seeing the same image twice. Good. But yeah, this is the variant uh, variant cover edition. Very nicely made. Of course, provided generously by one of my favorite manga companies, Code and Ship. Code and Ship Comics. Also yeah. known as the most... One of the most fucking expensive. Do they not sponsor? Is that Code and Show that they... The Code and Show? No, Code and Show sponsors Loot Crate. That's what I thought. Yeah. yeah. So if you like Code and Show... Yeah, Code and, I mean, Code and Show makes all the good comics, though. Well, I'm There's talking like, about uh, the... Are they nowadays. Loot Crate? Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, they're they're one of the sponsors, yeah. I thought it was so, kind of Katakawa that I seen. Uh, Katakawa does, too. There's a, they've got a bunch. they got Funimation, too. Um, the rumor is the next crate will actually have a DVD in it. Instead of uh, manga. They'll have an actual anime DVD, supposedly, or Blu-ray or something. Hey, I'm excited regardless. Hey, exactly. You know what? This crate, this crate's been awesome so far, and I think it's going to continue to be. There should be a little item at the very bottom of your box. Oh, I swear to God, if it's the thing that we was actually getting because it, the first time, I would be really sad if it's not. It, it should be there. So I've got mine. Shirt or bottom thing at the bottom box? thing. Bottom thing. You said save the shirt for next to last. Cause That's you true. Up last. Well, the poster kind of okay. All right. Fair enough. That's pretty dope. Yeah. Did you get yours? I did. What you do we got? Now, this month, uh, Loot Crate actually did this thing where they were uh, offering to people who subscribed for the first time an exclusive uh, cell phone keychain charm. 
And that is what this is. That's actually really cool. It's Even very though nice. I'm assuming it's, it's Loot Crate in Japanese. Loot Crate, yeah, that's what I assume it is too. And I believe that's Loot Crate in Japanese. It is real metal. Uh, string feels pretty strong and everything. All in all, I can't wait to hang it off my phone. And I guess then we're going to go and figure out how. Uh, I'm just going to put it on the case. Like the my phone case. Got like a case on it. I'm just going to wrap it right there. You're going to wrap it how? I'm sorry, I forgot. You're an iPhone. That's why I can do it and you can't. I'm just going to take it. Push this end in the hole. Pull it through. Oh yeah. Your turn. I call it that crap. <laughs> well, hang on. I can do this. I was gonna say you may. There may be a slot on your phone for it. Well, kind of sucks they don't have them for cell phone charms nowadays, on iPhones and shit like. You should have to drop this thing <laughs> in order for it to open. Oh, That's what, really Audubon? bad. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I don't. I don't see like this isn't gonna last long on mine. Like if I don't, if I keep it on there, it'll probably fall off. It's got metal right here, so like metal on metal is gonna scratch it all up, and it's gonna wind up taking out all that. Okay, this is pretty thick. It's plastic though, Durable. right? Mm -hmm. Plastic should be okay. It's just metal on metal won't uh, won't really. I have to. I have to figure out what I can do for this. It's actually pretty cool though. From? Clint. Huh. Hence why it was uh, the PlayStation theme. Yeah. Fair enough. Okay, shirt. Shirt. Yeah, shirt. we want to save shirt. the the other one that we've been waiting on. You want to save that one for last because it's got spoilers. So it shows everything that's in the crate and explains about it. Pretty much we've only got one thing left in the crate. Other than the shirt. Fair enough. So. All right, so without further ado. Yes. Yes! <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. I have been waiting for this shirt. I wasn't sure if you'd like it or not. Why? But th this this shirt is the reason that I'm dressed the way I'm dressed. I would say I, I kind of wondered was there a reason for your attire? Besides I figured you would you probably just, wanted... just assume that I'm trying to show off my inner otaku and just uh, disregard it. But yeah, that, that I have been waiting all week to wear this shirt. I cannot wait to wear this shirt to work tomorrow. I'm so fucking excited. <laughs> New shirt smell. Uh, it's got all the old villages marked out and stuff. All the villages, and then it's got the Akatsuki cloud. And it goes great with my robe, and you have a robe. I do. Now we have shirts and robes. Now we have shirts and robes. And I got Toby. I have a mask. You have a Toby mask. I have a Toby mask. It's from Josh. It is from Josh. It's the one you made out of paper mache, right? Yeah. yeah. I don't. I don't approve of it. I don't either. It's not very good, <laughs> and it's very uncomfortable. Super uncomfortable. And I'm not positive that he actually made that. Yeah. And I've never seen anything else he's ever made. Also, it comes from Ripple Junction, 100% cotton. Did you say Ripple Junction? Ripple Junction, indeed. Huh. They're pretty, uh... They, pretty have, they have a lot of the shirts that we have at the store that are anime yeah. shirts. Yeah, I was going to say, they, they're a pretty big name. I, I really like this shirt. Yeah, it's nice, dude. <laughs> That's what I say, the shirts, whenever you get shirts in Loot Crate, they don't skimp at all. Like, this one I'm wearing, this is a Loot Crate shirt. Yeah. Jokey. It's a Joker low, uh, low No, I couldn't I mean, understand that No, no, I figured you didn't, you know, because, you know, you're a wee bit. Uh, and then we've got... I know you're dying to put that shirt on. What size did you get? Large. Smart. I should have got an extra large. Look at the, the guy that's the assistant manager at FYE can learn how to fold a shirt on camera. No plugs. <laughs> no do. plugs. Cannot do it on in no the plugs. store. What are you going to do? Try to get magazine sales next? No plugs. <laughs> <laughs> we should bring Brandon in. I'm sure he'd do awesome. Pretty sure he'd freak in camera. <laughs> he had to read a script. Luckily, I write them. So have you seen this poster? You haven't seen this poster? So obviously everything's on the back that you get in the crate, like I was saying. That's why I wanted to wait for it, because they got the mystery anime box characters. I can't believe you got happy, dude. I'm so sorry. No, you're uh, not. <laughs> I'm really not. <laughs> but hey, he still looks alright. At least it's the winged version. You could have just got free. regular it fucking hair. I don't care. Well, well free. <laughs> it, uh, you know what I mean. Uh, from the box, of course it was 28 bucks, but it came with some awesome stuff, too. Oh, yeah. That was great. Yeah, and seeing this, this side has all the, all the stuff you get, and then this side is actually a poster. And, uh, I'm pretty sure it's an original. It's non-anime, like... I would assume, no, because I would know those characters. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It looks like an anime I would watch. 
So I'm gonna flip that to the back there so you yep. can see the front. Yeah, I can't wait to hang this one up actually. Kinda wanna kinda debating on where I'm gonna hang it, like ATM, so it's like I don't know where to hang it yet. Whether to do it in the living room. I think I'm gonna do it in my bedroom. I think I've got enough out of here for now. Need to get some more stuff hang up. So yeah, that's pretty much this uh, this month's crate, this month's anime crate, which is the new service they just launched. Uh, for those of you in the know, it's thirty dollars a month. Fucking cake, dude. Love it. It's great. What you think? I quite enjoyed my first crate. I'm not a sponsor to the normal loot crate or any other crates. I have been thinking about it, but I'm quite impressed by the value and what came in the box. Well, for the first box too. Well, I mean, if you come back for uh, later this month, I'll be doing the regular Loot Crate unboxing. You can kind of see what those are like, too. Yeah, I've seen stuff that's been pulled out of it, and this is my first box, so I'm not displeased at all. Oh, no, it's great. Plus, for anybody that does know and already has a subscription, next week's is Enchanted. Mm Mm-hmm. Got Magic, uh, No Game, No Life, and Awesome Anime. Can't wait to see what comes in that. I'm quite excited, dude. Uh for the NGNL stuff, because I don't know what uh, what they're going to do about it, but I get the feeling, dude, I'm, I'm telling you, something just tells me they're going to put the NGNL DVD in in the box. Something tells me that value would skyrocket. It's valued at 60 The crate is? The crate is. That's All these true. crates are valued at $60. Uh, the DVD itself is 60 Yeah. 50-something because it's a Sentai. Yeah, but Sentai sponsors the crate. Ah, uh, that's true. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. If... The only other way, like, if Yen Press started sponsoring Loot Crate Anime, that would be it. They're the most expensive comic company, and then you've got Sentai, which is the most expensive anime company. What? Say it. The Seven Seas is almost more expensive. Uh, Yen Press is up there, but Seven, seven Seas. Seas... I don't know. I don't read a lot of Seven Seas anime. Ah. What do they even have? They have a few. I can't think of any on top of my head that's on my shelf. I was going to say, do you even have any Seven Seas? Uh, I think Ninja Girls is Seven Seas. I've never read it. Ninja Girls is pretty good. Uh, actually, we're oh, in yeah. Magical, Magical, Magical Apocalypse. Apocalypse is Seven Seas. I knew oh, I was thinking of Golden my main one. In Golden Time and Toradora, huh? Well, then we can settle this argument right now. Toradora, Magical Girl Apocalypse. Uh, $12.99, yep. but it's $13.99 for Yen Press. And I know that because I've got your judge right here. And each one of them says thirteen ninety nine a volume. That's true. And then the bigger ones like Doubt and stuff, those cost more. Well, I couldn't imagine. They're actually the same price. Because Judge is thirteen, not thirteen ninety nine, and that's twelve ninety nine. Eh, true. So Yen Press is the most expensive comic company. Or I'm sorry, manga company. There like, you technically go. if they're Americanized. But you know, still, they're the most expensive manga printers in the current market by exactly one penny. Oh well, we gotta do it right. Mm-hmm. Still spend a lot of money and uh-huh. still happy with everything that comes out. Oh yeah. No, but the uh, the crate's great, dude. The, that was a great crate. I uh, I'll be <laughs> buying this from now on. Crate's great, great crate. <laughs> Good luck saying that ten times fast. <laughs> but no, it is. Too. It is awesome. Uh, it's great. I enjoyed it. And, uh, oh yeah, one last thing we didn't show. I don't know if you realize this. Every month, the box comes with a very specific design. This is Sword Art. Because, see, you can open up the crate and actually put the full design out. But, yeah, it's Sword Art Online. At least the top half is. Yeah, I was going to say. I'm not sure what the, the bottom half is. Bottom's not. No, the top definitely is because that's uh, the Iron Crowd Tower there. Yeah. So I don't know what the bottom is. It almost looks like kind of like the artwork and scenario of an Attack on Titan. Oh, it is Attack on Titan. That's Wall Maria. Good, good catch, dude. I didn't even picture it. Yeah, yep. I know. That's Wall Maria. Look at the guy who's now going to get comments for the video. You've never watched Attack on Titan. Oh, fuck was, uh, off. You know I've watched Attack on Titan. Who? You. I've not. Them. Oh. 
I, I named off all the characters beside Fairy Tail in the uh, mystery anime box except for the Attack on Titan characters. <laughs> so that's how you. Well, you're not an AOT fan though. I, I am definitely an AOT. I'm not, fan. but uh, I'm not going to be against watching it in the future. You should. I've got to. We both have a few different animes to catch up and be up to date on every week. Yep, we need to start doing the weekly podcasting stuff too now that I have weekends off and uh, I'm off after 10 o'clock, which is generally when you find yourself uh, no longer working. If I don't close. We can just do it from your store. (laughs) (laughs) Podcasting live from FYE! It's Kozaku no Otaku! Probably would not hear some pretty good stops. (laughs) Starring James Arness as Matt Dillon. Probably shouldn't, probably wouldn't hear some good comments on that. <laughs> his store manager, not my store manager, but just some store manager in general, is <laughs> like, he's an assistant and he's still at the <laughs> store? Like, really? You don't know anything about me? <laughs> and you hear one thing? That would be epic. That would not be epic at all. <laughs> that would be really upsetting. Ah, uh, you'll be alright. No, I was really happy about this. And I mean, well, I mean, if you do the breakdown, because I like to do these on occasion too, uh, just to prove the value to people. If you do the breakdown, you still got your poster out, or is it at the bottom? Yeah, it's at the bottom. I'm okay, bored. mine's easier to get to. No, it's not. Yours is cool. your box is closed. It's right here. Well, you had to pull stuff out of your box. I have a cup. We have a Hulk. <laughs> they have an internet. They have an internet. Yes. If you do the breakdown, and I like to do this because it's it's good to show, especially when you're doing videos about fucking over here, about what all you get. Typically, we were talking about this earlier. The the cell phone charm is an exclusive, so we'll we'll just omit that. But say you were to get one in stores, probably set you back what five bucks. The bandages probably about five dollars, something like that. The T-shirt, if you were to buy that at a store, twenty five dollars, easy. Store, so 20, probably about 20. We'll say twenty dollars. We were talking about these little ones here. Eight dollars each. Manga volumes. Does it have? A, I don't think it has a price on it. Does it? Uh, what is it? I didn't put mine up. It is coded. Yeah, it'd be eleven dollars. Ten ninety nine. Because it's coded and shipped. So. And the cup. Ten ninety nine. The cup is gonna the be. Mug would be at least nine. 20. No. Forty. That's fifty right there. That's sixty. Just right there. Sixty five. That'd be seventy dollars worth in this box. Seventy dollars, and we paid thirty for it. So I typically like to do the breakdowns like that too, because it just shows. Like when I tell people about this, they're like, "I don't want to. I don't want to fucking pay for a mystery box. I'm not. I don't know what I'm getting. I don't know if I'm gonna like what I'm gonna get." Here's the thing: I have Assassin's Creed coins and shit over there. I'm not a big Assassin's Creed fan anymore. I was on the first two games, and after that, not anymore. I've got an Assassin's Creed coin over there that is now worth $40 on eBay. Uh, it's generally what they sell for. And, uh, yeah, I mean, that's worth more. That's, that's two loot crates. Hmm. So it paid for itself that quickly. I paid $20. It was included in a crate. It was one of the items. And now it's worth as much as two of them. Two crates by themselves. So, yeah, I, I completely agree. This is, de- this is very worth it, and I like to do the value breakdowns for that reason. So, Loot Crate Anime, you guys can find it on the Loot Crate website. Um... I'll probably tag the link down below in the description. But uh, what did you guys think? Good? Bad? Yes? No? Maybe so? I don't know. Tell us what you think in the comments. Uh, like, subscribe. We're gonna be doing these videos a lot more frequently and everything like that. Uh, we should. Uh, we're probably gonna do another one here tonight about uh, some of the things that we're wanting to do with the channel. Kind of just talk about what this channel is gonna be. So uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. See you guys. <laughs>